Okay, what I'm going to do today is give you a, show you a demonstration on how to merge uh, files within SQL Server integration services. So, as usual, what we do is we kick it off uh, from Programs File, uh, SQL Server 2008, and then go into the Business Intelligence Development um, Studio and what this will do is I'll just go into one of my um, actual close out. I could have just clicked on that to get into one of my recent projects, but I'll just do it via the uh, via the uh, pull down menu. So what I'll do uh, today is I want to merge two different files together. And this is probably one of the most common transformations or functions that people use. Um, use SQL um, SQL Server um, SQL Server integration services for is to to pull uh, data files together. So what I'm going to do is going to create a new um, a new package. I'll just delete this old demo package. So I'll just call this um, rename. I'll just call it um, merge join. Um, and what um, what this package will do also is it'll uh, address a a problem which you quite often come across when you're merging two files together, particularly when they're different um, different uh, sort of data, the different data sources, and that's uh, to do with white space and the common um, way you quite often find this problem is when you merge two files together, you know they've got the same join key, but for some reason the result of the merge is it generates no no results. Um, so it's basically comes up saying no, no, there's not a match when you know that there are that it should in theory match. So what we um, start off with is a dragging a data flow task onto the uh, the workbench, and that is basically works as a sort of like an envelope to contain this um, extract transform load process.